How's it going everybody, Budgie Pokemon here, and welcome to my Lost Abyss Booster Box opening. I did say that I had an opening planned, and well, this is it. The newest set, the newest Japanese set I should say, Lost Abyss. This will make it over to English, I think in September, in Lost Origin, plus a few other cards, but we are here right now with Lost Abyss, so let me just get this booster box opened up. Alright, there we go. There we go. So, I can put that to the side and open this up. I would like to keep the box in good shape. <laughs> Alright, there we go. That took way longer than I expected. Right. So, in case you didn't know, Japanese booster box, 30 booster packs, each one containing 5 cards. And, in each booster box, there's at least one secret rare. So, this is something that is really nice. Let me just put this to the side over here so we can see. And, let's just jump straight into the first pack right here, I suppose. See if I can get this opened up. There we go. Get this out of here, and let's see what we have. First card, oh, I think this is, okay, so this is one of the newer cards, a Stone Journer. And I think this is called Lost Zone. I think this was in the game back in 2015. And it's now making a return, which is really cool. But we started off with a... It's not even a rare, it's an uncommon. So nothing in that pack, but we've plenty more to go. So... Let's just continue, I suppose. Open this up. Be very careful, just to the side, and let's see what we have. This is a really cool artwork, I really like this. Really, really nice. Alright, we have a Finian. We have a Lady. This has a full art in this set, which people are actually kind of excited about. I would r much rather pull the Chorus, but there you go. And another Lost Zone, Lost Zone Banette. Very cool, very cool. Now, I have opened up a few Japanese booster boxes, but I've never had, as I'm struggling to open this pack, but I've never had luck with pulling an alternate art from a Japanese booster box. I've pulled plenty in in English, but I've never pulled a, a Japanese one. Oh, look at this fan pee. Look at this. Isn't that, isn't that artwork just beautiful, this illustration? It's super cute and it's super well drawn. I really like this. Okay, so we have a first V card, a Rotom V. And after that we have a, what is this called? A Croc Rock. Alright, I have some sleeves over here. Let me sleeve this Rotom up. And put it right here, I suppose. Hopefully that doesn't mess with the focus. Ah, come on. There you go. There we go. Alright, we have a low punny. We have a C dot. Another fan pee, very cute. And a holographic sable eye. And then a mushroom. Sable eye. That's also very cool, I like this. Let's continue on. Hang on, let me put these back into focus. Uh, I think it's messing with the with the focus actually. So let me put these over to the side. Booster box right here. Open this pack up. Let's see what we have here. A Lost Zone Porygon 2. A Sun Current. A God, I've forgotten the name of this one. I feel like I should remember. Chin Chow, there we go. Oh, nice. This is this is actually really cool. I really like this. A Shift Tree Hollow. And a Lost Sweeper, I think this is called. Yeah. Alright. I actually really like Shift Tree. I really like the Gen 3 Pokemon. And Shift Tree, this Shift Tree is just amazing. Let's see what we have in here. We have a Beldum, another Gen 3 Pokemon. There we go. Uh, a Palosand. Stunfisk. And a non holograph comfy. There we go. And anyways, let's move it on to the next pack. 
head off to the side and get it on oh this is actually this is actually a really cool card as well i really like this one we have a ferrothorn i really like ferrothorn i think this is one of the pokemon i used in my original playthrough of don't get this wrong i think it's from black and white if i'm not mistaken a binacle oh and here we go okay we have a giratina v star what we have after that oh another gen 3 pokemon there we go a metang but here we go look at this a giratina v star this is such a cool card very cool let me pull up a sleeve for that one now there are, there is the Giratina alt art in here, but as I've said, I've never pulled an alt art from, from a Japanese booster box. I've only ever pulled a full art. But we'll see, the Aerodactyl is really, really cool. Of course, the Giratina, which is, which is crazy expensive at the moment. Oh yeah, look at this. This is another really cool card, a Vulpix. This is a really cool Vulpix. I really like this one. Another, what is this one? Gift Energy. And Waylord. Another Gen 3 Pokemon. I love the, I love the addition of the Gen 3 Pokemon. Really, really like that. Okay, let's get this open. This over here, and let's see. Nice horsey. A very cute, what is this called? Sandile. An Indeedee. A Buffalon, I think. And a talon flame. I'm still I'm still getting used to these new names. Or to the English names, I should say. Having played Pokemon in in German. I'm still getting used to some of the English names, so. Oh, I think we have something here. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on. We have something special, I think. This might be our secret rare. Okay, we have Thornton. We have a seal. Is that a bent? I think that's that's a bent here. Oh god. Hopefully that doesn't That's really weird. I don't know if you can see this. On the video. This car is like bent up here. Hopefully that doesn't come from opening the pack. Okay. We have a sandy ghast. We have a drowsy. And Okay, it's a golden card. It's a lost sweeper. It's a golden lost sweeper. Okay. This is actually really cool. Now, I don't know if this counts as our secret rare. Because if you can see right, right down here... Oh god, I'm in low power mode. If you can see right down here, if it would get in focus, it says you are which is ultra rare, and usually for the other ones it will say SR, which is secret rare. Just hang on. Alright, there we go, and we're back. I plugged my phone in so it doesn't die while recording. Uh, anyways, that's really cool. We've got a golden card. I've actually never pulled a golden card either from a Japanese booster box, so this is really cool. Let's see, we have an Amalga, Porygon, a Donphan, a Galarian Perserker V, and a Sunflora. This is also really cute. Look at this. Such a cute art. Super happy. I love this. Really, really love this. And a Galarian Perserker. Let me get a sleeve. Oh, that's two sleeves. And sleeve this up. There we go. And continue on. We still have plenty of packs left. We are still bound to get a few more Vs. And I think one more V star at least. I don't know if the gold card, if this gold card counts as the spot for the for the secret rare. I don't know for sure. I would hope that it wouldn't, but I guess we'll see. Guess we'll see. Okay, we have a Shuppet, a Phantom, Whalmer. This is called uh, Toxapex, right? And a Lost Zone Chromarand. Okay. Let's move it on. Let's see, we have a Chin Chow. A god, what is this called again? A Swarlix. A Spinda. Got a holographic glass tier. And a panic mask. 
Okay, okay. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Let's see, how many packs do we have left over on the right side? Looks like we have three packs left over on the on the right side. So let's open this one up. Then we'll go over to the left side. Really still hoping we can get a, a secret rare. Okay, here we go. We have a lantern. We have a sun current. We have a slagma. A holographic crocodile. And a seedra. Okay. That's actually really cool. Let's see what else we can get here. We're bound to get another V card. Maybe in this pack, maybe in the next one. So let's see. We have a Baniri. We have a Mushroom. We have a Finian. A Mimikyu. Okay, this is also really cool. Look at this card. This is such a, such a lovely illustration. I really like the background and everything. Really, really lovely. And a Mecargo. Okay, hopefully in this pack, there should be another V card. I think we should be getting two more. And then one more V star card. So here we go. We have a Time Pole. We have a Durand. We have the Pre Evolution of Ferrothorn, which is called Ferro Seed. We have the Pre Evolution of Dragapult. And a non holographic Porygon Z. Okay, we're moving on to the left side of our booster box. Get this back into focus here or back into the video. So, 15 packs left. Find a few more cards. Hopefully, 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 find a secret rare. Another Beldum. Oh, okay, here we go. This is another V-card, and we've got another Giratina. Really cool. Oh, and here we have Kores' experiment. So, another Giratina. Really, really cool, as contrasted to the Giratina V-star right here. So, we've pulled both of the Giratinas. Now we're only missing the Giratina V alternate art. Well, and I suppose the Giratina V full art. But, come on, if I, if I pull the Giratina V alternate art... I, I can retire. Of course, I'm just missing. It's not that expensive. It's still pretty crazy, though, for a modern card. In here. All right. So. Nice. Oh, that card has a ding there. I hope that wasn't from me opening it. Other cards seem to be fine. Binacle. A Hypno. Okay, and a Lumion. So nothing in that pack. Still got plenty to go. So Palo Sand. Oregon. Another cute Vulpix. A Lost City. And another Happy Sunflora. Alright, let's see if we can get another V-Star Pokemon. I think there should be one more in here. Maybe we can get the Drapion V-Star. Or maybe even the Curem V-Max. That would also be pretty cool. A Halucha. A Shuppet. A Spinda. A Holographic King Draw. This is also really cool. I really wanted to pull this card as well. This is really, really nice. And a Lost Zone Bennett. This is actually really cool. I really like this card. That is really, really nice. Okay. Let's see what else we can get here. We've got another Horsey. Another Indeedee. Another Sandile. Ooh, okay, we have a Fantina. Also, the full art in this one is really, really cool. And a Confe. That's the first time we've pulled the, the Fantina. Really still hoping that we do have a chance for for a secret rare that the the 
gold. The golden card doesn't take that spot, but it might. I'm not too sure, because usually it was say SR at the bottom. And this says UR, so maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Sandy Gast, Wilmer, a Drowsy. Ooh, nice. Here's our other V card. A Curem V. Really nice. And a Venomoth. Get a sleeve for this Curem. No, oh, that's the wrong way. There we go. Curem sleeved up. And let's see, how many packs do we have left here? I think we have about three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we have eight packs left. Let me get this booster box out of the way. Put these packs over here. And let's see what else we can pull. We've had a... I think we have something in this pack. So let me put the last card to the front right here. All right, we have a Slugma. A Sandile. A seal. I don't know if it's just a normal holographic or if it's actually some. No, it's just. Okay. Oh, it's actually a Metagross. Nice. A Gen 3 Pokemon. I'll take that. I'll take that. I just saw the shiny border and immediately thought it was a full art or something. But no. So there we go. Let's see, Porygon 2. Seal. Ooh, okay, so here's our second V-Star card. An Aerodactyl V-Star. I really like this one as well. Now, the full art for Aerodactyl is actually really, really sick in this one. In this expansion. I was really hoping we'd pull one, and as a last go, we have a Mirage Gate. I was really hoping that I would get, well, either my first alternate art from a Japanese booster box, and I was really, really hoping for the Aerodactyl. I mean, yes, of course, Everyone wants the Giratina V because it's expensive and all, but I would really love the Aerodactyl, to be honest. It looks, it just looks amazing. A few more packs here. At this point, I'm thinking the gold card has taken the spot of the secret rare. Sunkern. Buffalant. And a Dugong. Okay, a few more packs here left to go. I don't know if we can get another V. I don't think so. I think we've got all the V cards that we... that we should get from a booster box. Arrow Seat. What's this one? This one is a toolbox. And there you go. It's just four more packs left. And then we're done with this booster box here. If it would open, there we go. There we go, there we go. Low punny. Chin Chow. C dot. Oh, we got another hol uh, holographic. We got a Dragapult. A Dragapult holographic. Really, really cool. Right, let me put this over here. And three more packs. Maybe some, some last pack magic. That would be it, though. In, like, one of the last packs, get an alt art. Beldum. Nine tails. Okay, not in this pack, unfortunately. Well, we are not on the last pack yet. This is the, this is the second to last. This one right here. Second to last pack. Okay, we got a fan pee. We've got a Phantom. We've got the pre-evolution of Dragapult. And we've got another Lost Sweeper. Alright. Lost Pack. Maybe some Lost Pack magic is in order. Maybe some Lost Pack magic is in order. Let me just pull the last card to the front. Okay, we have a Nazleaf, we have a Lantern, a Baneri, we got a Binacle, and... Oh, we've got another Holographic, that's really cool. Ah, the, evolu the evolution of Binacle. We have a Barbacle. Right, so we finished with the Barbacle, 
Uh, unfortunately, it looks like that the gold car took the spot of the of the secret rare, but really cool, really cool gold card. Never unboxed a gold card from a Japanese booster box either, so this is definitely nice. Let me show off all the pulls that we have gotten. Okay, so we have gotten a Saber Eye Holographic, a Crocodile, we have a Kingdra, we have a Barbacle, we have a Dragapult, then we're moving on to the V and V stars, we have an Aerodactyl V star. Ah, oh, here, I forgot a normal normal holographic, the Metagross. And we have a Curem V, Giratina V, really happy about this one. Also about this one, Giratina V star. I forgot another holographic, a Shift Tree, a Galarian Perserker V, and a Rotom V. So this is all we've gotten from this booster box. Of course, I'm a little bit disappointed that we didn't get a alternate art, but all in all, this was an op awesome opening. I hope that you did like it. If you do, a like would be appreciated. Drop me a comment. Uh, if you didn't like the video, tell me what I should change, what I should look out for in the future. And if you would subscribe, that would be awesome. If not, no big deal. Thank you for watching, and I hope we'll see you in the next one. Peace.